Hello, uh, I'm Alan Kay, and in 1992, I got a phone call from a Japanese man who asked me if I had noticed that the next year, 1993, was the 25th anniversary of the amazing demo of what personal computing was going to be like in the future by Douglas Engelbart. And I said to him, well, yes, yes, I do realize that, and he asked me, if I realized that the next year, 1993, was also the 20th anniversary of the Alto personal computer at Xerox Park, which was the first personal computer like the ones that we have today with Windows and GUI and mouse and, and so forth. And I said, well, yeah, I remember that, but nobody in America cares about those things. And he said to me, well, in Japan, we do care about these things, and we are going to celebrate this 25th anniversary and 20, 20th anniversary next year. Would you come over and join us? And so I met the most remarkable, energetic, knowledgeable, and friendly Yasuki Hamano Sensei. And he was not just a major force in this celebration, but he was a noted historian. He had written several books about how electronic media came to be that ranged from the early work by Vannevar Bush in the 40s, working his way through Xerox Park and then into the, into the modern world uh, in the 80s and the 90s. And he translated these important and interesting ideas into Japanese and became a, a strong messenger for getting not just Japan, but the whole world to understand more about the media revolution. He also loved the special Japanese cuisine, served in very special restaurants, like his favorite restaurant in Tokyo, Maki. And he and I and our friends spent many, many happy hours there talking about media, education, the world, and how to make it better. Now he has gone from us much, much too soon, but he lives vividly in our memories. I think of him as an eminently civilized person. And a person who is civilized isn't somebody who's gotten to a place, but a civilized person is a person who's trying to make the world more civilized. It's not a place you get to, it's a process. And this Hamano Sensei did in so many ways, through his books, his teaching, his involvement in helping others understand the world better. We will miss him greatly, but we are very glad we knew him, and we are very glad for the life that he lived. Thank you.